What's going on everybody? Welcome back to yet another video. And what I got for you guys today is the best combos for the brand new starter pack skin Iris. As always, make sure you guys hit that like button down below and enjoy the video. Now to start the back wings off here, we have for the first one as Black Hole. For our second one, we have Cuddle Bow. For our third one, we have Obinous Orb. For our first sword back wing, we have Wolfpack. Our next back wing we have here is Blade Bag. For our next one here, which I like this one a lot because it adds a lot of contrast to the skin we have here is Goodie Bag. For our next one here, we have another one which is really one of my favorite back wings in Fortnite and that is Shining Star. Our next one we have here is Scarlet Eggs and I think this really goes well with Iris. For our next one here, we have another starter pack back wing and that is Palette Pack. I really like the purple and the aqua green for this skin. Now a back wing that really matches well with the color is definitely going to be Lumicore Red. Now for our next one here, we have the back wing as Infatuation Pack. It does have two styles to it that you can select from. It does have a purple style. But for me to go well with more of the skin, I'm definitely going to go ahead and choose the pink style. Now for our next one here, we have is the Heartless Backwing. This is part of the Leftover set in Season 10. For this one, of course, if you watch some of my other videos, you know this is one of my favorite Backwings in Fortnite and Starfield. Continuing on with the Backwings here, we have the Backwing as Ninja's Edge. Now for the customizable Backwings such as Banner Cape and Banner Shield, you are going to find a lot of options that match with it with the colors. You have a lot of colors on the skin with the pink, the kind of reddish orange, and the dark blue. Of course, you can match any of the banner icons that you want with this skin, but you do have a lot of options with these two bat wings. Now, moving on to our next bat wing here, we have the bat wing as a birthday cake. For our next one here, we have floral shell. I really like this bat wing on this skin. The black adds a lot of nice contrast, especially with the flowers. For our next one here, we have another bat wing that kind of goes with the infatuation pack, and that is Scully Satchel with the pink heart. Now, for our next one here, we have a bat wing that was just recently added into Fortnite and Skeleton Wings. This is a really dope bat wing and one that I'm going to use a lot, not just for Iris, but definitely for a lot of other skins. Moving on here, we have Shelly, and Shelly has a style on here. It does have three, but for this one, we're going to go with the pink and blue one, being that it does match well with Iris. For our first wing bat wing here, we have Shadow Wing, a really bright bat wing that goes really good with Iris. Our next bat wing we have here is Reliant Blue. If you want something to go well with the dark blue and add a little bit of contrast with the black, definitely go ahead and go with this bat wing. For our next one here, we have the bat wing as Ghostly. This is kind of an awkward backpack bat wing, as you don't see a lot of things like it, maybe other than Heartless. It does go well with the kind of pink and reddish in it and the black adds of course some contrast to it just like this last back wing i showed you but moving on to our next back wing we have here the back wing as smoothie for our next two back wings we do have these back wings that are very similar to one another you got them both when fortnite introduced zone wars into the game the first one here is Starcrest Flux, and the next one here is Starcrest Shift. Of course, you can see with the red and the blue, it does go well with Iris. It does have other options that you could choose from with the purple and blue if you wanted some more contrast to it. But if you wanted something that's going to match more with the color, definitely go ahead and go with these two colorways. For our third to last bat wing here, we have the bat wing as Hurricane. This is a bat wing that was just recently introduced into Fortnite in the item shop that was supposed to go along with the Tango outfit. Of course, the all pink really does match well with Iris. It does have some lime green in there, but to me, it does add some really nice contrast to the combo. For our second to last back wing here, we have a back wing that doesn't really match well with the colors, but it still is good with Iris and Sunsprout. And for our last back wing here, we have a back wing from the Season 7 Battle Pass, and that is Trail Tote. The colors do kind of line up with the skin itself. Now for our pickaxes here, we have the first one as Harmonic Axis. It does have more selectable styles that you can choose for it with the purple. You can also choose the other two styles if you want to, but to match up with the colors of the skin, I definitely would go with Harmonic Axis with the purple style or even the red style to match really well. For our second pickaxe here, we have the pickaxe as Scully Sickle. For this one, we're going to choose the blue style to it, not the green one. But to match up with Iris, we're going to go ahead and go with this style of it. For our third pickaxe, we have the pickaxe as Sledgehammer. If you want to add some contrast to it, definitely go with the purple style. But if you want to match well with the colors of Iris even more, definitely go ahead and choose the blue or the red style. For our fourth pickaxe here, we have the pickaxe as Street Sign. This is the pickaxe that you had to win in the complex tournament if you got the top 25%. For our fifth pickaxe here, we have a pickaxe from last season Battle Pass and Boulder Breakers. For our next one here, we have the pickaxes as Cupid's Dagger. I really like this pickaxe with Iris if you have one of the heart back wings, as you can see if you look at the bottom, it does have the two little hearts on each one. For our next one here, we have some more pickaxes from last season Battle Pass and Highlight Strikers. Of course, you do have multiple styles to choose from it. You can go with the pink and black one, or you can even go with the yellow and black one if you want. But of course, matching up with the colors of Iris, you're going to go ahead and choose the original style to it. For our next one here, we have the pickaxe as Scarlet Sky. Moving on to a pickaxe here from the Season 10 Battle Pass, we have the pickaxe as Sparkle Sky. 
For our next one here, we have a pickaxe that is really, really unique, and that is Spell Slinger. Of course, more selectable styles to it would be orange one, but of course, for Irish, we're going to choose the blue one. For our next one here, we have a pickaxe that's really going to match well with Irish with the pink, and that is Birthday Slice. For our third to last one here, we have the pickaxe as Icicle, one of my favorite winter pickaxes. For our second to last pickaxe here, we have the pickaxe as Rose Glow. For our last set of pickaxes here, we have the pickaxe as Twilight Striker. You are only allowed to get this pickaxe through a certain set of challenges, so if you weren't able to complete those challenges to get this, unfortunately you will not be able to get this again. Now for our gliders here, we have the first one as Arcana, a very bright and very unique glider. For our next one here, we have the glider as Magic Wings. Honestly, one of my favorite gliders that's ever been in Fortnite and one that I use for a very, very long time. For our third glider here, we have the glider as Metal Mark. Of course, you do have multiple styles to choose from it, but if you want to go with the style that does go well with Iris, definitely go ahead and go with this style to it. For our next one here, we have a very old Season 4 Battle Pass glider in Sugar Crash, one that goes really well with Iris with the bright pink, and of course, all the other candy on it does add some really nice and bright contrast to it. For our next one, if you want to go with a more subtle pink, Definitely go ahead and go with the Rose Glider. For our next one here, we have a glider from the Season 7 Battle Pass in Royale Air. For our third to last one here, we have the glider as Scarlet Strike. Now getting into the Umbrella Gliders. For our second to last one here, we have the Babbling as Beach Umbrella. For our last one here, we have the Umbrella as Holographic. To get this one, you had to get your first one in Season 9. Now for our contrast here, we do have a lot of contrasts that go well with Iris. So to start off this long list of contrasts here, we have the first one as All Star. For our second one here, we have the Contra as Beat Drop. For our third one here, we have the Contra as Bubbles. Our next one that we have is Celestial. For the fifth one we have is Fiber Optics. For our sixth one here, we have a Valentine's theme one in Hearts. For our next one here, we have a really bright and new Contra in Spectrum. For this Contra, if you want to match well with the Sledgehammer Pickaxe, definitely go ahead and go with Slurpstream. For our next one here, we have one of my favorite Contras in the game, and that is Shooting Star. For this one here, we have another pink contro and rift lighting. Our next one here, we have another one with the blue colorway and plasma trail. For this one, this is a very unique and very bright, and the colors do change on it in neo tubes. For our next one here, we have a season four contro and spray paint. Our next one here matches really well with the colors of iris, and that is swirls. For this one here, we have some more blue contrails and ultramarine. Our second to last one here, we have a really bright and colorful Contra and Vibrant. And for our last one here, we have a Contra that is one of my favorites and one that I've used a lot in Fortnite and Zero Point. For our wraps here, we have the first one here as Dark Angular Shift. For our second wrap here, we have a wrap that's one of my favorite in Fortnite and one that I'm going to use a lot with Iris and that is Slurp. For our third one here, we have a wrap that you were just recently able to get in Fortnite through some challenges with the Beacon Trance. For our fourth one here, we have some more Valentine's themed stuff with the wrap as Cuddle Hearts. For our next one here, this is also another one of my favorite wraps in Fortnite and Internal Zero. For our sixth one here, we have another recently added wrap that you were able to get. Just like that pickaxe that I showed you with Street Sign, you got this wrap through the Complex Tournament if you got the top 50%. For our next one here, we have the wrap as Chick. Moving on to our bright and colorful wraps, we have here the wrap as Frosted. Some more bright and colorful ones, we have here the wrap as Neotropics. Moving on to some more, we have this one as Pink Splatter. For our second to last one here, we have the wrap as to Tilted. And for our last wrap here, we have the wrap as Valentine. And that is it for today's video. If you liked any of the combos, make sure you guys hit that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. And I'll see you guys next video.